So the next step is to activate the event linkages for access control. So to do that, go to the transaction SWE2 or you can also come to the screen using SPRO. So if you go to SPRO, reference IMG, GRC, access control, workflow access control, not there, okay. It's not in work access control, not, not in workflow access control. It should be in general settings, workflow, and then you go to change event. So let me, it is going to give you a message because I'm already in that screen. So it gets to the same screen. Okay, so let me come out of it. Okay, so you can go via transaction code or via thus pro path all right so what you need to do is in this in SWE2 for all the object types or the receiver types that you see which has GRAC right all of these many there are many so wherever till from here to SPM audit review for all this uh, object types double click on each one of them one by one and click on select this linkage activated and then in behavior upon error feedback has to be do not change linkage and then receiver status has to be no errors okay for each and every object type you have to make those settings so if it the very first time that you do the first one it is going to prompt you for a transport request you can put them in a store no, no, save the changes in a transport request so a linkage activated behavior upon error feedback has to be do not change linkage and receiver status has to be no errors now we have to do for the all the object types that have GRSA in it okay so let's double click on the second one linkage activated do not change linkage no errors then you say so you need every time you activate and save type linkage activated checkbox is going to be checked do this no errors save do this again the next one linkage activated do not change linkage no errors save Okay, let me go back to the previous one yeah it's okay so let me go to the next one so like this you make sure these three are you know linkage activated do not change linkage and no errors for each and every one of them I'm going to pause this video now and do the remaining ones because it's the same steps I'm going to do for all of them okay so there's no point in recording everything all right so I'm going to stop pause the video now all right so we have activated all the even 
and the receiver types and object types or GRS. So let quickly check some some of them randomly to see everything is okay. Okay, and let's check the last one. All right. So you have to do activate each of these object types with uh, linkage activated, behavior upon error feedback as do not change linkage, and receiver status as no errors.